before practice, when we was in the locker room, Kaylin, she was very emotional. I wonder what happened with her. <laughs> my dad died because he's not. Oh my God. <laughs> I got a phone call from my sister. And the first thing she said to me is like, hey Kate, um, I just wanted to let you know that dad died. <laughs> He's been struggling with addiction for years now. It was to the point where he was living in a homeless shelter. I think he just dealt with a lot of demons. And for my mental health, I had to cut him out for the past eight years because he was a toxic person to be around. It's just kind of like a lot. It's not like I'm worried about the fight. It's just like, it's why? Like why when now? you're trying to put it behind you, it's like yeah. the trigger that brings back up. Like, I get it. Yeah. yeah, I get it. Why now? You know? In one of the craziest weeks of my life, my dad dies in the middle of it. Sometimes that. it's hard to say, like, and it sounds ridiculous. Some of these things come together for a reason. Yeah. You know, and it's like, if it's one more thing that's it's pushing you on a certain nerve right now, it could be pushing you on a different nerve right. next week. You know yeah. what I mean? So I, I know it's tough. Like, and I, can't even I can't even imagine to put Me myself in your shoes because, like, man, you're still here, you know? Yeah. yeah. You're here. When I got Kayla in my team, especially now she's very emotional, you know, had daddy pass, and have your coach in those moments. That help, you know. You can't say that it's gonna. You're not gonna think about it anymore. It's only natural. But well, you got your fight coming up. I know that's gonna help a little with concentration. You like have that ahead of you. I was a little emotional just thinking about everything. Amanda and all of her coaches were so awesome. They really helped me in that moment. I tried to just focus on achieving the goal that I came here to achieve. <laughs> Thank you. All right, everybody, welcome to Weigh-In Day, which of course is the best day because we get to fight tomorrow. Let's get it started. Uh, Team Nunez, Catlin Neal versus Team Pena, Helen Peralta. Caitlin. You're up to the scale. Up to the scale, Caitlin Neal. Uh, 126. Yay. Caitlin looks great. She's been beating me up in practice. <laughs> Kaylin's got a very strong game all around. And then brought to the scale. I don't want to fight Helen. I would rather fight any heavyweight in this house than fight Helen. That girl can brawl. Now it's time for the first flyweight fight. Helen is a bare knuckle boxer and Caitlin is a wrestler, so this is gonna be the classic striker versus grappler matchup. Caitlin is fighting Helen and she is a monster, man. She has great striking, she's got great takedowns. Helen is a monster too. She will throw down with anyone. I think though that Caitlyn is the more well-rounded fighter and I think Caitlyn is going to win. <laughs> 